Anyway, the same man that I know who was selling weed and all this and that to his son, yeah? It's the same man. <laughs> I met a youth, right, in jail. He went to my school before, innit, yeah? And he's one of them bad white boys, yeah? You know them man that get kicked out of school from year seven, yeah? You don't even see a man in year eight or nine, yeah? Man's out of school from year seven, yeah? Man not even in classes. Man's just always in internal exclusion, always excluded, always in, yeah, like detention after school and that anyone. Bad youth. Anyway, bumped into him in prison. I remember my first, when I first arrived at ISIS, HMP ISIS, SC28, Thames, we didn't, yeah? Right opposite Belmarsh, yeah? Chatting to him, yeah, it were in the waiting room or whatever, innit? Yeah, and I knew he knew someone I know, innit? Older man that I know, innit? Yeah, he told me, right, this man that he knew, right, used to work with young people, whatever, innit? Yeah, he told me he used to drive around with this older man. So, this white boy who's an impressionable white boy, yeah, easily influenced, yeah, because he's young, yeah, used to drive around with an older man who was supposed to be like a care worker for young people. If you're a care worker for young people, you're supposed to be influencing young people in the right way, yeah? Not in the bad way, yeah? In the right way. This young person is driving around with someone who's supposed to be influencing him in the right way. He's driving around with him on the lunch breaks, whatever, in it, yeah? During the day, licking shots. You heard it right, yeah? A man is drug dealing with a young person in his car with him. Yeah, who he's supposed to be looking after, who they're an impressionable young person, the type of young person who they live in a home, yeah, their parents don't want them, they're homeless, whatever, innit? they live in a home, they live in sheltered accommodation, yeah, they might have a foster parent or whatever, innit? Yeah? this man's supposed to be driving this kid around telling him stories about, you know, I know this person, they were on drugs before, and this is how their life turned out, so you don't, jump on drugs. You stay far away from drugs. Nah, instead, he's driving around with this you in the car, licking shots, licking shots, licking shots. This is the same man who's selling drugs to his son. People are insane, fam.